Many of the 75 children in this orphanage have lost their parents through war and have experienced a lot of heartache in their short time. But the Sitara Orphanage in Kabul is giving them an opportunity to create new memories. Yet I don't want them to feel sorry about themselves, but rather to feel that they are very special. And Disha Farid has created a safe environment at 11 orphanages in Afghanistan. Troops from New Kabul Compound stop by to bring boxes of winter clothes, but more importantly, to tap into their more nurturing side by spending a few hours here. It makes me feel a lot better. It's a, it's a side of me that I don't get to uh, show every day. I'm a parent. I'm a full-time parent. I love kids. I don't have any, but I miss my nephews and niece, so I thought it would be rewarding to come and visit. To be able to play, to do the uh, mom thing, just to watch them and see how they all are one bigger family here. This visit lasts only a few hours, but these soldiers, sailors, and airmen believe it's time well spent and the impact will hopefully last for years. If we treat them well and we tend to their needs and put the past behind us, then they're pretty much a whole new generation that could just set the country straight. And while the next chapter in this country's progress has yet to be written, these kids can experience all the unique expressions of just being a kid with the help of some big kids. Petty Officer Liz Murray, Kabul, Afghanistan. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television in Washington. For the latest military news and information, check out Army.mil.